All right, this drill is for Henry and Henry only, or if anyone else wants to get a good forehand tip. But Henry, so you were asking about how to get that good, consistent release out of your forehand, whether it's a flex or a hyzer flip. My number one tip is to add spin to the disc using your wrist and getting this motion down. The reason why so many people just have that flobbly wobbliness to it is just there's not enough spin to the disc. You're moving your arm too fast in comparison to the speed that your wrist is moving. If your arm is moving fast but your wrist isn't doing anything, then you're not really gonna get, you're, you're, it's gonna be no, low spin and that's a lot of wobble, not really good angle control either. So we're gonna try and add spin by just flicking discs at the basket. I did this for a long time, just trying to get that wrist motion down. Just, just like that, I'm just, I'm not even moving my elbow. There's maybe like a centimeter of movement, but I'm just getting that flick down. I'm just getting that flick down and just standing here from 25 feet, you know, and just flicking over and over and over, getting that wrist movement down, strengthening that forearm muscle. So your wrist needs to move faster on a full throw than your arm. Your arm shouldn't do much. And I'm about to throw into the net right here. I got my net, I got some other discs. Watch how I follow through. Watch how my wrist moves quicker than my arm at that snap. And I'm gonna follow through like this. All right there, a couple more. I'm gonna do a flex right here. Even in that angle, add the spin, add the spin. Heiser flip right here. One more, a flex right here. It's all in the wrist. Get that wrist motion, do that drill with the basket, it'll feel a lot better.